What's going on everybody? Welcome to the third part of this series of videos where I'll be covering some more features of Oxygen OS 10 on OnePlus Nord that you might not know. But if you do, then stay calm and watch it anyway. And I'll leave a card to the other two videos that have some more cool features that you might have missed. So you can watch those after this one. Anyways, so without wasting any time, let's get started. So the first one in this list is a bit of an easter egg. Well if you go into the calculator app and just type 1 plus is equal to, you will get this never settle easter egg, which is somewhat matching with the software part on Nord, but whatever. And one more thing, there is also a tiny scientific calculator option. So just swipe up like this and there you go. I guess you probably knew about it, so let's move on to the next one. The second feature is in the dialer app. So this one really helps if you don't like to interact with your device whenever you get a call. So open the dialer app. Now click on this three dot menu in the top right corner. Now select advanced from the list and just turn on flip to silence. Now whenever you will get a call, just turn your device upside down on a flat surface and it will mute that particular call. And it comes in handy in case you are so damn lazy to interact with your device. And I was talking about myself all right. Next one on this list is screen pinning option. So it has been there on Android devices since a long time now. And this one basically enables you to lock your device on a particular screen. And it is a sort of anti-child mode. To enable this, you will have to turn off the gestures on your device first because... Now in settings, go to security and lock screen and enable screen pinning. So all you have to do is open the recent menu, long press on the app you want to pin and select pin from the list and your device will stay on this screen no matter what you do. And I can already see people making good use of it while handing over their phones to various relatives. So to unpin the app just long press on the first and third button that is back and recents together and it will ask your password again and unpin the screen. And I find it really neat and underrated feature of Android. Moving on to the next one. So one tiny complaint I have with this device is that there is no option to lock the device to LTE only in settings. Mm, not till now at least. And this fluctuates the network sometimes from 3G to 4G and vice versa. And you don't get the best possible speeds because even low 4G signal is better than 2G right? Well to do this open dialer app on your device and dial star hash star hash 4636 hash star hash star and you will get into this testing menu. So click on phone information and in here choose network type to LTE only or whatever you wish to do and you are all set. So the device will be locked to LTE only until you reboot. Last one that we are going to cover in this video is OnePlus Switch. So as the name suggests, it can be used to migrate data from any Android or iPhone to a OnePlus device. But it has one more use case and that is to backup all your apps, messages, photos and other data. So to backup, just open OnePlus Switch app and then click on backup and restore option. So select new backup if this is your first time and then select what data you want backed up. And then click on backup now and wait for the process to complete. So in case you want to restore, open the same backup and restore option and this time click on restore button. Now choose the files you want and you are all set. So these are all the good features of Oxygen OS 10 in OnePlus Nord that I find really handy. And that was it for now. Do like this video if it helps you out. Share it with your friends and subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. So I'll see you in the next one.